Mondays aren't always that bad when they look like this, right? 69 degrees here at uh, just about 11.30. I've got 45 minutes before I need to be back at school, so why not go see if there's anything cool downtown? All right, boys, we made it here, and uh, I haven't seen anything too incredibly nice yet, uh, but there's a really nice looking 335 over here. Uh, I noticed a lot of people around here buy a 335, tint the windows, put nice grills, wheels, exhaust on them instead of doing an M3. That's probably a good economical decision, but I'll walk over, might as well take a look, and I'll show you. I'm not a fan of the black grills myself. I'd rather have the stock grills and the shadow line trim instead of the aluminum. But with the tinted windows, nice wheels, and uh, the dual exhaust that the 335 has anyways, looks awesome. There's Grandpa and the Benz. Oh, we spotted a uh, old 6 Series E24 and an Audi S5. I don't think there'd be much competition there. But let's be honest, they're both beautiful cars in different ways. And so is that. Ah, nothing like Monday, two hours off in the middle of the day. Just come downtown, sit here in the sun, 71 degrees, and watch the Audis, Benzes, and Beamers roll by. Uh, check it out, we got the... Uh, the sports wagon here and money, 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 money out there, Mr. Brinks. Well, guys, it is just freaking fall summer here. 73 degrees. I apologize for those of you on the opposite side of the world. You're now in the fall trying to keep quiet about it. I've got 73 degrees and sun and everything's green and people are putting mulch down and X5s and, and freaking rights. I love it. Hi, Jack. Oh, in route on a beautiful day, still 76. I'm gonna go get some quotes on replacements and repairs for the windshield, so uh, I will let you know what I find out. It's a beautiful day for the highway, ladies and gentlemen. Damn, that is one low, incredibly smooth engine. Look at that idle. Can't even feel it running. Ah, crap, just missed filming it, but there's a brand new black Rolls-Royce Ghost that just went by. Looked really nice. Okay, so we're looking at uh, just after 4 o'clock now. I'm over at the grandparents' house, parked down here to try to avoid all the seed pods and crap that's kind of coming out of the trees. We went over to this place in Akron that my dad has had glass work done before with, and he liked them. So we got a quote for fixing the windshield, which he said would be possible, uh, but you'd still always see it knowing it's there, and you know how anal I am, so... I elected to go with a new windshield, so then we had options. to go with BMW OEM, which was $200 more than the other three brands they showed me, and being who I am, I decided to do that. I want OEM parts in that car. I don't use cheap aftermarket accessories, aside from the damn headlights. So um, we ordered that. It'll be in Wednesday, install Thursday, $700 new OEM BMW windshield. But uh, I guess that'll be good. So we're gonna have dinner out here. Now we're gonna get some pizza. I have high hopes that it will be better than last night. We're gonna eat out on the deck, among the fountains and the birds and the beautiful trees, and there's the blue sky. Well, there's eight cylinders there, 385 horsepower. There's eight cylinders there, 295 horsepower. There's three cylinders there, 69 horsepower. And there's eight cylinders there, which was 394 horsepower. So BMW said, and last time Dave Walter, it told me about 419. That's a lot of horsepower. Oh. The joys of home ownership, right? Friggin' blower up here, blowing seed pods around. Uh, actually, the first time I've been up on his roof, I just ended up using that little ladder there. But if we jog up here, you can see this is on top of a, a three-story house up here. There's the M5. Driveway is down here. And he's got the easiest roof that I think I have ever worked on. And well, all three roofs I've been on. Check this out, though. It's like no grade. It's big, it's flat, we got a chimney here. It's no big deal. So he's off blowing the stuff around down here. See if I can hop this without killing myself. Should be able to. Uh, yep. So, uh, job well done. All you need is a still, five minutes, and a ladder, and you can clean all the seed pods off the roof. Oh my god. What a freaking mess I just made. I did not realize it's that much. That's gonna be like an entire trash can of stupid oak trees. They have these these seed things that you probably know about, but look at that, it's like a basketball. Wrapping up the vlog here, uh, we pretty much cleaned up all that crap at my grandparents' house and had our pizza and stuff out. So actually, that was after dinner when I went up there, but that was really good. 
pizza and cheesy bread from Marco's out on the patio or the deck. It's like 75 degrees. It was supposed to be 70 today. Uh, but anyways, that wraps up Monday. I'm just kind of in here editing this together. And my Watch Later playlist has been an absolute disaster over the past couple days. I'm talking to Bobby here. Um, I had about 60 videos in it two days ago, and I'm down to uh, 18 right now. Uh, catching up on Fastlane Daily from the 14th. Oh, that's today. Monday's the 14th. All right, so that's not bad. But Colt had a bunch of years. Some of them are like 30, 40 minutes long. I don't know what's up with Pug. He's uploading 30-minute videos now. So it's still going to take me a couple days to clean those out because there's a lot of long ones. But it's a work in progress. So anyways, windshield comes in Wednesday, goes on Thursday or Friday. That'll be nice. All OEM seals and stuff. And that's it for today. So I'll talk to you guys in 520 tomorrow on Tuesday. Good night.